Hi kids, hi everybody. How are you? What? Is there a spider? Where? Is there a spider on me? Where? On my arms? Oh, oh man, on my neck. I'm, I'm so afraid of spiders. Where? Is there another spider on me? Where? What? On my head? Oh no. On my hair. Oh man. There's a spider on my head. I'm so afraid of spiders. What about you? Welcome to Joybox Creative English School, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this class because learning English doesn't need to be boring. If you're not subscribed yet, subscribe on my channel. Don't forget to activate the notifications and tell your friends and family about us. It's really important and I really enjoy that you guys are here today. So let's start. Okay, get ready. Let's start and now it's time to... There's a spider on my hand, on my hand. There's a spider on my hand, on my hand. Oh, it is a big disaster. There's a spider on my hand. There's a spider on my hand, on my hand. There are two spiders on the table, on the table. There are two spiders on the table, on the table. Oh man, I'm so disabled. There's a spider on the table. And it's time for us to read a book. And the book today is Mini Beasts by Maulisa Kelly. The words for today Warm Ladybird Beetle Snail Grasshopper Spider and Caterpillar Let's go! A warm Wow! Yucky! A cute little 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 lady bird lady bird a beetle a snail a grasshopper a spider another spider over here And a caterpillar. Time is over for us to read the book. Don't forget to memorize the words. And now it's time to... Reading game! Don't forget to pay attention. Listen, repeat after the teacher and memorize it by heart. Alright, let's go. B. B and the spider spider flying dragon flying dragon ladybug or the ladybird ladybug Ladybird. Also, a butterfly. Butterfly. And ant. Ant. Now is your turn. Please say the right words in a very loud sound. All right. Good job. Next one. 
Do you remember? All right, next one. Good job, you guys. What about this one? Yes, on my shoulder, on my head. Say it again. Okay. And the last one, but not least. Very good. I hope you enjoyed that. Let's go. Time is over for us to play the reading game. And now it's time for us to open the joy box. Let's open the joy box and see what is inside my joy box. Can you see it? Can you see through? Let's open it. Take the lid off. Wow, look at that, you guys. There's this many pieces in here. Oh, we don't have much time, but look at that. How cool it is. Let me put the box aside and see my pieces. Do you like to play this game? Let's make a caterpillar. A very big and long, large caterpillar. Let's use two or three colors. Three colors? All right. Let's use the green one. Mm, let's get seven. All right. One, two, three. Oh, dark green. Okay. Four. Five. Look, let's make a big caterpillar. Maybe making curves. All right. Let's see. Let's make a curve with it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now let's change the color, all right? Let's get, what color do you want? Is it blue? No? All right. Is it purple? No? All right. Um, orange? Okay. Let's make it seven, all right? One, look for it. Two, under here, three. Let's make a curve. Four, this way. Five. The caterpillar is coming out. One, two, three, four, five. Um, mm, is there orange yet? Yes, there is one orange piece. One, two, three, four, five, six. Is there another orange? Can you see, guys? Yes, seven. So now, what color do you want me to put in the color pillar? Mm. Is it white? No? Okay. Is it the brown one? Okay. You don't want? Okay. Black one? Okay, thank you. Let's see if we have seven pieces in the black one. One. Look for it. Two. Three. It's getting so long. Four. Make a curve. All right, I'll make a curve. One, two, three, four, five, six. Only one missing. Seven. Now let's continue with the first color we used. So we have no, okay, we have like two pieces of the dark green, but I will exchange with the light green, okay? Seven pieces, count with me, I'll do it fast. Go, count, one, two, three, four, count with the teacher, five, let's make a curve, six, all right, and seven. Wow, how long is the caterpillar we have? What color do you want me to put now, is it orange? Let's try to find the oranges. Oh man, there's only one. Only one orange. Can we use another color, please? Can we use yellow? Because they look a little bit similar. Okay. Count with the teacher how long my caterpillar is getting. Oh man, count fast. One, two, and three. Let's make a curve. Oh man, that's hard sometimes. 
four. Curving. Oh, it's too big. I cannot control my caterpillar anymore. Four, five, six, and seven. What color do we need now? Only the black one? Let's try to find the black ones. One, two, oh man, it's getting big. There's a big caterpillar on my table now. Three. Is there any black one? Yes, only one, maybe. Four, five, and there's no black anymore. Let's get two brown ones. One and two, just to complete. And now, look at my big caterpillar. Time is over for us to play this game. And now, it's time for us to make a caterpillar out of paper. So, in order for us to do this activity, you're gonna need, at first, paper. A sheet of paper, and I've got two. I want a white one and a pink one. You can use the paper you have at home, okay? Also, you're gonna need a pair of scissors. It's better if there is no point. It's not sharp, all right? and some crayons so let's start let's fold the paper in half just like this okay and then after you do this again you fold again so we have four parts okay let's do the same with the white paper so get the paper you fold it in half first, then you fold it again. Now we have four parts, okay? And you only need to use one of these parts. So you're gonna cut it. Maybe you can sing with me, sing along with me, the spider song. There's a spider on my table, on my table. There's no spider. There's almost a caterpillar. Let's cut it. Cut, cut, cut. Okay? Now you don't need the white paper anymore. Let's do the same with the pink paper. Sorry. Right? Just get one part and cut it. There is a ant on my table, on my table. Are you afraid of ants? I am not afraid of ants. Not at all. Are you afraid of spiders? I am. I get frightened by spiders. So guys, now you fold again, okay? And do the same with the other paper, if you have two papers. If you have only one paper, all right, no problem. Okay, I'm not afraid of caterpillars. Are you afraid of caterpillars? Let's fold it like this. Can you see it? All right, fold and fold it again and fold it again. Let's make a very nice caterpillar, a white one and a pink one. So you can fold, 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 but just like this. You see? Now you have a paper like mine, you see? All right, let's do the same with the other paper. Let's do this, let's make it different. Half, all right, half again. Let's do differently. All right, so now I have this. Fold, one part, another part. All right, let's fold it again. Fold and fold. Maybe it's gonna work, maybe not. Let's see. Okay, I have a pink one and I have a white one. Now you turn the paper, choose a color. Okay, let's stop for a while. I have a game for you guys. Question, are you afraid of ants? I am not afraid of ants. But I am afraid of dragonflies. All right. I am af 
afraid of spiders. But I'm not afraid of ladybugs. Good job. Let's continue then. All right? So now you chose a color. And you're going to make a small ball, just like a head of a nice caterpillar, just like the teacher is doing. Look. Nice ball, just like this. Do the same with the other. I'm going to change the color for the green color, all right? Let's make a small ball, just like that. Um, all right, let me get the good parts. And you're not looking for, okay, I found it. Head. Okay, this one's a little bit smaller. Look, there's no problem if they're not perfect. Okay, so now let's cut it. Let's try to cut. Let's see how it goes. Now it's almost a cut of filler on my table. A little bit hard, not so easy. Not that easy, let's try, let's try. There is a caterpillar on my table now. Almost there. Okay. That's not so round. Let's fix it. You can try to do a little bit better than mine. I don't have much time. It's not a nice caterpillar. Look at that. Let's go to the white one. Maybe it's going to be better. Let me get the garbage over here. All right. Try to do it. Man. Because the paper is so thick, you see? It's not easy to cut. Maybe you should get less paper left next time. Oh, okay, less paper next time. It's very hard to cut. All right, let's try it. Oh, all right, let's get the garbage out of the table. Just put it beside you. Okay, let's just stop for a moment. I have a small caterpillar and a big one. I don't need those paper or those papers or those crayons anymore. But I do need my people over here. I'm not afraid of spiders. I am not afraid of ants. Are you? What are you afraid of? I am afraid of dragonflies. But I'm not afraid of ladybugs. Okay, let's continue. Open your caterpillar, look at that. How nice and big caterpillar. Now let's get another one, the white one. <laughs> okay, not working, two caterpillars then. All right, you guys, now you can make a face on it. You can get some crayons, let me get the black one for this one and make some eyes and a nice smile. You can do this and you can make a nice eyes and hmm, not so happy smile for this caterpillar. And maybe this one, which is a very huge one. Oh, I didn't see that coming. Now we have four caterpillars. All right, no problem. I'll change the color then. I'll get the dark blue, dark blue color. Make two eyes uh, in different face. Confusing. Let's make an angry face. Angry face. Okay. Kind of. So, time is over for us to make the caterpillars. And now it's time to say goodbye to the teacher. Is there a spider on me? No anymore, not anymore. Say goodbye, teacher Marilia Joyce. Goodbye, your folks. I'll see you next time. Hope you enjoyed the class. Bye.